Hey, hi guys. Uh, in this video, I am going to show you how you can create the training sample for the deep learning to perform analysis on the satellite imagery. So, at first, uh, go to your favorite browser. I am going to the, uh, I am opening my Google Chrome and uh, source for uh, and download the satellite imagery. Okay. Uh, you can download the download the satellite imagery from the any any of the source uh, like the auto, uh, you can download the any on sentinel imagery sentinel 2 imagery landsat imagery or uh, the any on imagery but uh, at this time i am uh, downloading i am downloading the uh, aerial imagery from the switzerland okay uh, let's let's get start okay uh, at first i am going to source over the uh, switch topo dot admin dot ch and okay uh, it provide me a data set uh, okay let me change it to the uh, english and uh, this site provide me a data set of the switzerland uh, in the 10 centimeter resolution and here you can see the sample imagery you can easily is easily detect the detect the roads uh, roads cross walls cross walls even the even the triangles on the road and easily and the vehicles you see and just scroll down and okay uh, if you also want to perform the analysis uh, analysis on those imagery those images are totally totally free and this uh, it provides the imagery on the grid wise manner so simply zoom in to the layer, zoom into the area of the interest. Here I am zooming to the zooming to the layer. Okay, uh, this one. And so click on the click on the uh, on square button and just click over the search button. Okay. Okay. Let me again click over the search. My interest internet speed is uh, slow, so I'm getting lag lag over it okay uh, if you have the high internet speed you can easily okay let me click to this link okay and here I am I have got the imagery and let me click to the download button and the download will automatically started and the the file size is 63 uh, 63 MB and I have already downloaded the imagery so i uh, and it is located inside my download folder let me browse to the download folder and let me source for the imagery uh, i have yeah here it, here, here you can see that uh, this one is the uh, yeah this one is the imagery i have uh, already get downloaded so let me go to the link and go to and simply uh, cancel the uh, cancel it and go uh, and browse the imagery here i have kept this imagery so simply copy this imagery and okay me yeah, this one here is my preview <laughs> okay let me just click uh, click to the copy copy and go to the another text huh. and I am a uh, fiber freelancer, so <laughs> all these folders are in the okay. Let me delete all those files, okay, and simply click to the paste button, okay. Here, uh, here you can get and uh, simply and go to the and I am using a QJS, so uh, I source for the QJS, QGIS okay uh, this one is the universal idea to create the imagery and the uh, label of the imagery uh, from the satellite uh, satellite data sets so you can apply all those uh, this uh, these methods to collect the to collect uh, to make the labeled imagery and to create the small patches from the satellite imagery to the any of the anyone uh, and, and satellite, whether it is um, Landsat imagery, uh, sports satellite imagery, MODIS dataset, 
uh, or the uh, or the area imagery look like this and you can also uh, do this method on the ortho imagery from the aerial photographs okay uh, go to the layer and go to the add layer and go to the add last layer and browse to the folder i kept inside the fiber so oh, go to the new column d inside fiber i have kept this imagery and simply click to the open and simply click to the add and right click and i am i am going to predicting the uh, predicting the crosswalks automatically uh, detecting the crosswalk in inside the imagery so uh, at first we have to create the label imagery of this this one is the uh, this one is the image and we have to create the label file of it so at first go to and simply zoom into the layer and here you can find you can find the crosswalks and go to the layer and go to the create layer and new shape file layer and i am going to create the uh, create a crosswalk c r o s s s w a l k crosswalk okay and zoom to type the polygon and i simply match this uh, projection system to that of the image projection system and simply click to the uh, simply click to okay yeah H here we have the crosswalk and okay and go to the edit edit the uh, edit the imagery and simply click to the this link this and this and this and at last left right click on it and simply click to one and simply enter okay you get the polygon polygon of the chorus walk and sim uh, uh, it's like this you can digitize all the cross walk in present inside the satellite imagery okay simply click to the and again this time two and source over source for the other cross walk presents in the uh, satellite imagery and here i am going to do this And three okay uh, yeah mm. uh, I think uh, I have digitized all the crosswalks present in the present in this imagery okay here it is and here it is another and simply click to the okay and four yeah and at this time okay uh, go to the and simply go to the crosswalk and save the imagery and simply press click yes save yeah and here you can see okay uh, here is the here is the crosswalk and go to the zdal and go to the vector processing vector geo process okay vector conversion override with the fixed value uh, yeah input vector layer is the keep the crosswalk is the vector layer input raster layer is the swiss yeah this one and okay and just simply uh, and change this value to the 255 200 okay let me let me cancel it at first. It first copy this imagery, export, save as. Okay. IMG. Save. Simply click to OK. We are uh, uh, during the processing or the during uh, training. During training, we need the imagery, uh, this original imagery, along with the original imagery, along with uh, um, original imagery, along with the label imagery. So we have copied this imagery and go to the override with the fixed value and IMG 220. Okay, and simply cross walk at the first and 255. 255. Yasan. Yeah, and simply click to the okay 
and okay and let me click over it and if you zoom over the this region you can uh, notice that uh, the uh, crosswalk crosswalk uh, digitized with the, uh, this value okay simply go to the raster and go to the raster calculator and uh, image 22 is going to be equal to 1 it's equal to uh, 255 255 and uh, this image is the level l a v e l okay and click to the save and simply click to okay okay here you can here you can find the level image of the it okay